finished it. Hello friends, you are welcome. Before we begin today's tutorial, please find the link above to download and subscribe to Filmora Wondershare. It comes with a special discount for you. Enjoy. I'm using 10 pictures. Make sure the toggle on the left side is on, then select all the pictures and drag them down to the timeline. Right click to crop to fit all as shown. With all the pictures selected, go up and click on the duration icon, then change the duration to three seconds so that each picture is three seconds as shown. Now right click to copy all, then go to the left side to add two more video tracks. Click on track three, then paste the pictures as shown. Next, for track two, go to Effects. Search for and drag down the square blur effect, then extend it to match the duration below. Afterward, click on the effect and increase the blur size to three, as shown. Furthermore, go to Effects, search for Overlay 03 Border, then drag and apply it to the first picture on track three, as shown. Next, click, then go up and click the crop icon. Select the 16-9 aspect ratio, then go up to select pan and zoom. Adjust the grid as shown, and then go to the bottom right corner to click the swap button for start and end positions as shown to apply. Click, then go up to apply a keyframe for transform. Scale up to 138. Afterward, move the playhead to one second, then go up and apply another keyframe for transform, scaling down to 70, as shown. Afterward, I stretched the timeline in order to click the keyframe panel icon, then selected all the scale points as shown. I right-clicked, chose Bezier Curve, and applied Ease In. Afterward, I scrolled down and clicked the icon on the picture to minimize it, as shown. Now I right-click to copy the effect, as shown, then select the rest of the pictures on the same track and paste it as shown. Afterward, I preview it quickly. Next, I further went up to Transitions, searched for, dragged down, and applied a dissolve transition on track one. I then right-clicked the transition to copy it selected the rest of the clips on track one and pasted to apply the transition as well. Then I went to the last picture and deleted the misplaced transition as shown. I went back to transitions, this time to search for strobe split transition. You'll see three different strobe splits, so I dragged down and applied them consecutively as shown until the last picture. Lastly, I went to Effects, searched for and dragged down the Apfel effect above, then extended it to match the duration below. Afterward, I clicked to reduce the opacity to 20%. So thanks for watching, you are awesome! The template link for this tutorial is in the description, along with a link to download Filmora with a 45% discount. Have a beautiful, lovely day!